named all the presidents. And I did the milk gallon chug. I did a backflip. <laughs> Debbie's double jointed. We get it. Hey, Dax, what about you? Yeah, Dax, you haven't yeah. gone oh, yet. Oh, yeah, no, I don't have a secret talent. So. <laughs> what? Come on, man. It's a secret <laughs> talent party, uh, dude. Whatever. Your talents are like super lame. So. <laughs> uh, dude, come on, everybody's got one. What's yours? <laughs> all right. Um. I guess I have like a super stunning voice or some shit. <laughs> Wait, what do you mean? What does that mean, dude? Like, all right, fine. <laughs> Whatever, my voice is so gay. <laughs> oh, dude, it's amazing. <laughs> so lame. So either that crowd, yes, that crowd. Come on, man, you're just trying to top yourself again, dude. Like your time traveling salesman's great. It killed tonight. It kills every night, man. I mean, it's never gonna be your baby centaur character, but you can't get applause breaks in every sketch we do, man. <laughs> so you're saying I've peaked? Jesus, come on, man. No, all right, no. You know what? In five years, you guys, you'll all be famous and on your own TV shows, and I'm gonna be working at Dave and Buster's in. Northridge. Sounds about right. Yeah, that actually sounds yeah. like you. Okay. Yeah. yeah, fuck you, fuck you, fuck you, fuck Dave, you. Dave, come on, man. All, We're at the dude. pinnacle of comedy now, man. We're performing sold out crowds every single week. I mean, there's nowhere to go but up. Look, if none of us make it in five years, I will get a job at Dave & Buster's. How about that? So I'm gonna be there huh? and you're gonna apply it above me. No, Is I'm, that right? I was so hoping like, you'd be the manager by then, you know. Well, that's very sweet of you. You can be a baby about it? You can be the baby. If you're a baby, I will treat you like a baby. Get out of here! Why are you, you Come on, we're gonna be famous! Damn! That smells good! I feel like I could just eat the smell of it. Whoa! Someone could lose a finger in those chompers. They should call you crazy chompers. <laughs> Yikes! Maybe they should. Yes, and they should. Yes, and that's because you're crazy. I really like that we're making pizza together. <laughs> and I really like that I put cheese on our pizza. It's really Gouda cheese. <laughs> <laughs> this pizza is crazy. Okay, Ashley, not everything is crazy. Why? Just stay in the scene. Okay, you're not crazy, but this place is insane. Yes, and I really like this place. <laughs> okay, all right, all right. Yay, yay, yay. We'll work on that. Um, let's get uh, Henry and Kendra up there. Um, you guys can stay. This is a beach scene, so um, take it away. Woo! It's a hot one. Yeah! It's crazy hot! I never made sandcastles on the beach with such a beautiful woman before Susie would she kiss. Okay, alright, alright. All right. Uh, that's it, that's it. You know what? Uh, you know, guys, we're just gonna end it for the day today. Right. So, um, um, Mr. Dye, did, did I assume wrong, Mr. Owen? Actually, yeah. You know, I don't think it's the right call to go in for the kiss, especially since you do it every single time you're in a scene with Kendra. I never really noticed that. Everyone else did. It was funny though, right? Hi. I like your hat. Huh? The pineapple on your hat? Oh. Um, thanks. Did you get it at the Renegade Craft Fair like two days ago? I did, actually. See, I thought so. <laughs> I was there. The hat's part of my best friend's line. Yeah. <laughs> did I buy this hat from you? I think you did. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> um, <laughs> Owen. Oh, uh, Miranda. <laughs> Do you live around here or? No. Do you? Uh, no, I, I work over here, so. so. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Cool. <laughs> you? Oh, 
Uh, yeah, I'm just taking this like new improv class. And the sad thing is, I think I'm gonna be the funniest person in the class. I mean, I'm not bragging, but I just recently did this guest star on Modern Family. And I looked up the guy who's teaching the class and the only thing he's ever been in is like this Liberty Mutual commercial. So where do you work? I teach improv. Right around the corner here. I'm not starting a new class. I don't think I'm your teacher, but. Um... <laughs> yeah. Well, I'll see you around. Yeah. Please tell me you're gonna smash that. What? Uh, you and Runyon Canyon back there should. Fuck, man. You could cut that tension with a wooden spoon. I don't, I mean, I don't think so. She's a student. Uh, I always fuck my students, all right? Guys love being dominated by their teachers. Yeah. Classic mommy complex. Yeah. You know, okay, you know, okay, you know Carl, I, I, I feel like that's a massive conflict of interest, actually. Why? Uh, because, because it's a pass-fail class. Uh, no, 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 I never pass students I fuck, all right? I don't show preferential treatment. <laughs> okay, break's over. Time to destroy some precious babies' lives. And hey, Owen, stop being a chump, all right? Sometimes you just gotta get what you want. <laughs> Think about it. Hey, get back to class. Guys, shirt's optional on this one. I don't know, man. Maybe you should just quit teaching. Quit comedy and all the bullshit and just move on. You'll be so much happier. That's what I plan on doing. I can't quit. I need the money. So get another job. I'm not qualified for another job. I can't even get a job at Dave & Buster's. Why would you want to work at Dave & Buster's? Five years ago. Never mind. What is wrong with this thing? Probably stuck. But it needs to be not stuck, Owen. Maybe it's not teaching that's the problem. Maybe you just hate yourself because you're not as successful as you want to be. I mean, I hate myself. I don't think I hate myself. Maybe you should just quit doing comedy. Find something you like doing. Like me and DIY cork projects. It's honestly saved my life. Every time I feel shitty about myself, I just start a new cork project. And you remember what I was like before corking? Fuck! Wasn't that bad? It fucking bombed, dude. They didn't get it. They're tired. It should have been earlier in the show. It's a think piece. Fuck! You know what? I honestly, I don't even care anymore. Clear. Right. <sighs> You're gonna be great. Thank you. You're a fucking piece of shit, you fucking loser. If you don't get any last tonight, you're gonna kill yourself. Hey, just tie my bed sheets up. She's gonna go get a gun. Just go home, eat a bunch of fucking poison, you fucking loser, rat. You're not gonna kill yourself because you're a fucking coward. Man, that's the truth of that. Okay, I'm ready. Yeah, I don't think corking's really my thing. Well, no, you have to find your own thing. Corking's mine. I think comedy is my thing, though. Well, then double down. Double down. Yeah. Try even harder. Push yourself. Double down. What are you dickwads doing back here? Nice outfit, Kim. Oh, thanks. I uh, just got back from this commercial audition. Disembodied head. Ooh. Science. Thought you guys were supposed to be working on your screenplay. We took a break. You're always on a break. Yeah, you're right. We should probably get back to work or we won't hit that deadline that Ron fucking Howard gave you us. Fucking... Fuck Ron fucking Howard. I would if he gave me a job. Love you. Love you too. <laughs> fucking piece of sh- Oh, it unscrews. God damn it. Dana. Hey, we got you an audition today for Ford Tough. Today at 10.30, that's 10.30 today, Ford Tough. Can I confirm you for today, 10.30, Ford Tough? Uh, I don't think I'm gonna... <sighs> yes, yes, I'll be there. 
Oh, okay, great. And uh, Ford Tough wants you to come in looking Ford Tough. Like, you know, manly, tough, not roughneck tough. Can you do that? Can you look Ford Tough? I'll do my... Great. Hello? Ugh. Got any change? Um, no. Come on. Okay, where's this thing? Routing. Santa Monica. Routing. Okay. Destination: seven point four miles away. Estimated time in traffic: two hours and forty-seven minutes. Nope. Yo. What? Yo. Hey. Hey. Bitch. Fuck. Hey, it's my car. No parking on this side of the street. But I just, I can move it. Good for you. <laughs> Bitch. Double down. Thank you so much for this. I mean, I, I really needed it. Do you want to do an improv show with me tomorrow night? Is that why you had me come over? Yeah, I figured if I asked you over the phone, you'd say no. Ah, <sighs> no. Oh, but please. I'm not really into doing comedy right now. Why? I'm in this weird place where I don't find anything funny right now. I mean, all I do is watch young comedians and critique bad comedy all day, so the whole thing just kind of feels like a chore. That I've been doing this for 10 years and the past five feel like a complete wash. Maybe you should just try and be happy. Ugh, I feel like when you have to try to be happy, it's just a sign that you're actually really depressed. Oh no, Owen! Don't be sad! Being sad's the worst! No! Uh, okay, I won't. Yay! 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 So you do the show? No. What the fuck? Why is this door unlocked? Hi! I think I actually left it unlocked, sorry. What's up, Owen? Look, man, you're a guest here. I'm Marie's friend, so I forgive you. Thank you. How was your audition? Oh, I killed it, seriously. Plus that dude, Darren, was camera operator, so feeling good. What was it for? Ford Tough. Oh, I, I think I was supposed to go in for that. Yeah, yeah, there were a lot of uh, like character types there. I'm gonna go for a run a little bit if either of you guys want to join me. Colin's doing a 10K for kids with leukemia. Oh, that's very nice of you. <laughs> yeah, but dude, you could totally do it too if you want to, seriously. I'd love to train you if you're open to it. I mean, you got the neck built for running, so you should take advantage of that. You seem like the kind of guy that would probably like grow a lot in that kind of experience, you know? Are you oiled right now? Yeah, I grease up before it's like, improves the speed, obviously, oh. in the shoes, makes a difference. Oh, um, Watch out. I actually, I don't run, so. Actually, I have to run now. I have to go teach a class, so. Are you sure about tomorrow? Yeah, I don't think so. <sighs> Lock that door on your way out now, please. Eight, Five. nine, 10, 11. 12 purple bananas. No, uh, Baker's half dozen of macaroni oranges. Great, these are all made up toothpaste. Whitey fresh. Simply teeth. Uh, fox. Not fox. Fuck dicks. Toothpaste. Anal. No. Uh, I don't know what you want from me. Uh, guys, I have to take this. Um, let's do a one-word story. Jailer, you can start. Once upon a uh. anal. Hey, Dana. Um, so sorry. I was Owen, teaching. Owen, listen. 
You know that audition, that Ford Tough audition we sent you on this morning? Um, yeah, uh, Dana, I'm so sorry. I, um... You got a call back. What? Yeah! Ford Tough love what you did, and they want to see you come back again. You and just a few other guys. They said that? Yeah, Ford Tough liked you a lot. They thought you were really tough, like the right kind of tough. Okay, um, yeah, I'll, I'll make sure that I'm, that I'm there. Sounds fun! <laughs> get better. Like, you're so mean to me sometimes, though. I am hard on you because I care, all right? I'm just trying my best. I, I know. Hey, listen. Improv, it's, it, it, it's like a muscle, all right? You just need to work it out. You, you should get that. Oh. I, I know, I just, I, I don't know where I'm going wrong anymore. Hey, 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 hey. You're not going wrong, all right? You just have to be more vulnerable. Good for her. Hi! I decided I'm gonna do the show tomorrow. You will? Yay! Yeah, I'm doubling down. I don't know what that means, but I'm glad you're in. What made you change your mind? Uh, well, I, I got a call back, and, uh, which is weird, because I didn't even go to the first audition, but um, I don't know. I kind of felt like it was just the universe or something. The universe is so cool. Yeah. The universe brought me all those fruit roll-up commercials I did, remember? <laughs> cool. Okay, yeah, I'll see you tomorrow. See you tomorrow. All right, bye. <laughs> Not today, Dave and Busters. Not today. Oh, God. Can I talk to you for a second? Uh, yeah, sure. I really feel like I'm not really living up to my potential right now. I just keep doing all the things that you've been talking about in class, but I don't feel funny. I don't know what to do. Okay, um, wow. You know, it's just a matter of time. This whole thing is just such a series of ups and downs, and it is so easy to get discouraged, and I have to remind myself of that all of the time and it sucks because there are people who get it right away but most of us it takes years the worst thing that you can do in that situation is say that you're not good enough or that you don't deserve it but you do and if you just work hard and put in the time it may take years but you will get it i don't have years my plan is to be on saturday night live by next year i think i might just be overthinking it sure Just so you know, from one star to another, I can tell that one day it will happen for you. Not even gonna let that bother me. Doubling down. Routing. Routing. Estimated time in traffic. One hour and 59 minutes. You know what? Doubling down. Delay. New arrival time. Three hours and 57 minutes. Double down. Double down. You can do this. All you have to do is double down. Just double, double down. Gwen? Gwen? Um, it's Owen. Owen? Yes. Looks like you wrote Gwen. Oh, sorry. I mean, like, why would you write Gwen? I don't understand. I don't think I did anything. I think it's just my handwriting. Then why'd you apologize? You know what, just come on in. Trash. <clears throat> Everyone, this is Gwen. It's Owen, actually. Uh, okay, hi, Owen. Uh, I'm the director. This is my co-director. I'm sure you got the sides. 
Uh, you don't need to read them. We're just going to go with some improv today, if that's okay with you. Okay, great. Yeah, that's great. Have you done much improv? Yeah, I, I, I teach improv. Oh, okay then. Um, so your neighbor wants to hitch his boat, but he can't because he doesn't have a Ford Tough like you. That's the premise. Mm -hmm. Be confident, but don't boast. Yeah. Okay. Play, play the humor of it, or is it more serious? Yeah, just don't boast. Okay. And action. Hey, neighbor, that's a pretty big boat. Your neighbor's name is Jim. Hey, Jim, that's a pretty big boat. Yeah, I'd love to take it down to the lake, but my car doesn't have enough horsepower. I'm sorry to hear that. You're not sorry. Ah, oh, maybe I could help you with my Ford. Ford Tough. I could help you with my Ford Tough, Jim. No, you can't. That sucks, Jim. Don't say sucks. It's too bad, Jim. Can we you, do something real quick? Yeah. I just want to make sure. Darren, will Darren, you just you go wanna... run in real quick and yeah, just show cool. him how you did it earlier? Yeah. Oh, okay. So just watch him for a minute? Yeah, just stand and there and watch. Easy. Oh, okay. Just help you with my Ford Tough. Something like that. You teach improv? Yes, I do. Maybe we should teach improv. I don't know, right? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I feel like we just were. Yeah. Thank you, Gwen. Thank you so much. Thanks, for your time. Man. Thank you. Why even why even bring me in? What the actual fuck? Do you do improv? Do you do improv? Yeah, fucking do improv. Fuck. Fuck. Fuck me. You know what? No? God, I hope I book it. Hey, Owen. Can I talk to you a second? Yeah, what's up, Mike? I'm sorry. What do you mean you're sorry? Theater made some cuts, and you were one of them. What? My show killed tonight. Yeah. <laughs> so I'm done. Yeah. Did they say why? No, they just... I'm sorry, man. Shit. I am so sorry I'm late. It's okay, they started late. Um, is it just us two? Yeah. Everyone canceled. Is that okay? Do we even have a crowd? Colin's here, and if the team is up now, stays, then yes. So, just Colin. And the other team, if they stay. It'll be fun. Can we please just cancel? No, I signed up for it. That's why I want to do it. I don't. I, I don't think I want to do this right now. Then why did you say you could? I don't... Can we please... Please just cancel. When did you stop having fun? Maybe if you stop worrying so much about the crowd, you'll just have fun. I know. I... You know what? You don't have to do the show. I can just do it myself. <laughs> okay. We are Marie and Owen. Can we get a suggestion of a location to start off? <laughs> uh, bean factory. Our only suggestion. Okay, great. Bean factory. This bean factory's really going under. I need this job for my family. What am I gonna do? Well, I guess you could start stealing the beans if they're gonna lay us off. We might as well be able to feed our families. Uh, hey, look, a knife! What are you gonna do with that thing? Well, I thought if I stabbed you, we could get workers calm. Not a bad idea. Uh-oh, but... here it goes! Oh, 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 you got me right in the kidney bean. Oh, Ooh. okay. Um, uh, maybe we fill it with the beans. 
We fill it with the beans. Okay, this this is not working. <laughs> messed up. You know, I really wish you'd get this emotional in your scene. I'm never coming back here ever again. And I'm not picking up your dog from puppy daycare. Who said I wanted you to come back? I got another class starting next week. Huh. Oh, yeah. He's dead. Boy, that song was half as bad. Was he thinking? Lock the door on your way out. Shut up!